here we're gonna go over the steps on how to replace the airbag on a Volkswagen um, so the first thing that you will need to do is disconnect the battery negative terminal right here we have the battery there's a negative just loosen that knot right there and then pull that off to the side now once you do that you'd want to wait at least 15 minutes the other thing is that when you work on the airbag make sure you keep a two feet distance from the airbag just in case it explodes while you're working on it and also make sure to handle it with care because it can cause injury injuries but uh, on this Volkswagen the way that you remove the airbag is in the back here and we're gonna look at that in just one second uh, you have this upper trim this simply just comes up you can use a trim removal to just put it in this gap right here and then you lift it up on the front and you push that back now on the back of the steering wheel in some models you would see uh, a gap right here turn it a little bit actually so you see a, a slot right there where you just put a screwdriver and push down on that but in this model there's no no gap for you to push it insert the screwdriver but what you do have is this little hole in here and it's actually it's um it's just an indent and it doesn't look like a, a hole that goes through but what you will use is a screwdriver to punch through that hole so you'll take your screwdriver and then just punch through that hole yep and then now once you do have the screwdriver in there you would want to push it towards the, the center of the airbag right i'm pushing down and let me show you right here we have the airbag released already so right here you can see a screwdriver and the way you want to move the screwdriver is this way so you're going to move that screwdriver that way to release the airbag if you're looking at the back of the airbag what you are actually doing when you insert a screwdriver through the hole you're actually coming right here into this spring you'll be right in there you can actually if you move the uh, screwdriver in the back like this you can feel that but you basically would be pushing that down that way as you do that it releases the airbag right up there and down here and you have this in both sides so you'd have you have to punch these holes on both sides you can see the holes right there and right there now once you do that you still you're making sure the voltage the battery is disconnected uh, keep a safe distance from the airbag in order to remove these wires um, right here you have the airbag wire you have to pop this orange part out and then pull out the, um, the electrical connector so you pop that up like that okay and then once you do that you can remove the wire or if you the other option is to simply pull on this right here and then undo the whole connector right there so you can do it either way right there. but uh, right here we have the volume controls so you want to disconnect this as well uh, I'm pushing on this locking tab on the back here there we go and that's it and make sure to keep the airbag a safe distance from your body and put it in a safe location